They've added six new guys to the rosters on the 10-day hardship contracts. Most of those, Mike Conley misses on the first. Well, yeah, you just you just know one. He's got NBA pedigree. Dad played in the league for tons of years. I played against him. But when you watch him play and you just watch the pace that he plays, that he understands a game. He plays with a high level IQ. With the Lakers, he's a Hall of Famer. He's a NBA champ with Dallas a decade ago. Bogdanovich off the pretty fake. Here's Conley. We'll try from deep. Boy, that, speaking of adding things to your game. He's gotten better out there the older he's gotten. At the end of the day, yeah. you're you got an opportunity. You talked about Brandon Knight being back in this league. You want to maximize this, maximize it so you can stay here. Conley gives him that experience. Uh, as you mentioned, an all-star last year. He was terrific in the playoffs. Minnesota win on Thursday. 11 and 3 since Thanksgiving. They've won 10 of their last 12. After giving up 34 here in the first quarter. The talk after this quarter is going to be about ball security. Conley with the cross. How about the ball handling skills and the jab steps? Those last two possessions for Utah. Fourth triple of the half for Utah. That 15.7 threes per game. And that Brunson trying to work on Ingles who may not uh, be fully committed after the tee. Mitchell off the bounce, uses the window and he's got it. Porzingis has his size advantage. Short on the shot, tipped out to Conley. Head up, finds Bogdanovich and taken away by Brunson and now numbers for the Mavs. And the foul committed by Conley. Pinson will try for three. Here comes Conley. Conley wants a screen. There's Rudy Gay. And nobody went with Mike around and out. Chance for one last bucket. Competitive first half, extremely decimated by COVID and injuries. So, you know, you want to compliment this team because they are putting together a pretty good effort. They are one of the lowest scoring teams in the league, Richard, but they are on pace for 126 tonight. And Jason Kidd, is he? because you understand as a coach, he's out there talking, communicating, trying to help guys with some of these rules in the zone because you have a lot of guys that just don't have experience. As you see Bogdanovich knock down an easy three. The Dallas Mavericks have been bringing energy and effort to this game. Again, no practices, no shoot arounds as Mitchell gets to the rim for the lane. Well, number two all time, number two in steals. Of course, folks here know who number one is. John Stockton's banner hanging in the Can I give an unpopular opinion? Yeah. You want to be a part of this. You want to be a part of this organization. So players accept their roles very quickly here. Conley looking for somebody else and then decides he'll take it on his own. The defender's job to avoid the screen. Looking for the lead into the fourth quarter. Conley for three. Doesn't get it to go. That starts a long break to go to Sterling Brown. He'll drive it up, miss that layup, and the ball's loose to Clarkson. Good Clarkson defense there to prevent that. And we, we talked about it earlier. This is just for players. It, it, you don't get to this league without being a fan of this league. And if you are a fan of this league and you grow up for these players, I'm so glad that Rudy Gay and Conley get the opportunity. Both of them had some amazing years in Memphis. Tried to drop it off to Gobert and Rudy couldn't hold it. And here comes Brunson on the run. Conley into the passing lane. This crowd is just waiting. Ingles off the bounce and it goes. And here comes Brunson on the run, Conley into the passing lane. This crowd is just waiting. Ingles off the bounce, and it goes. Don't rush it, because you're going to get what you want. Here is Chris Stops. Conley. Good box out by Powell. And so consistent for them in the starting lineup. We'll get a free look here. 
the Utah Jazz, they are in a position where they got this crunch time opportunity and they got to maximize it. Runner off the window again from the right hand of Mike Conley. Under three to go. Brunson short. Conley is there and he's fouled. That, that I'm not going to lie, that takes me back. Because he was, <laughs> he's like, I think I have to catch and shoot. And Jake Kidd was like, 81% from the line, and Mike makes the second. That's a 22-point game.